a tentative timeline of events in the book of Revelation. A fresh approach. To compile this timeline, we followed the following guidelines. 1. We assume that the book of Revelation borrowed its structure from the ancient Greek tragedy, which consists of a series of overlapping episodes. 2. We avoid equating events in the book with historical or modern events, persons, or nations. 3. We group together phrases that seem to us to refer to same or parallel events. 4. With a few exceptions, we choose not to declare which events have been fulfilled in history, are being fulfilled today, or must be fulfilled in the near future. 5. We focus only on earthly events, choosing not to include most events that occur in the heavens. 6. We do not describe the details of major events. And 7. We have ordered the events in an arbitrary, numbered outline for convenience. We have classed the events of the Book of Revelation around these ten themes. A tentative timeline of the book of Revelation. A few events were fulfilled in the first century. End time events occur in a duration of 42 months. 1,060 days, or three and a half years. During the Great Tribulation, thousands of believing Jews and Christians will suffer persecution and martyrdom. Jesus Christ will appear visible in the sky, from whence he will raise his followers to life. Next, the wrath of God will be poured out upon the non-repentant and upon the beast. Jesus Christ will descend to earth as a conquering warrior.
he will then establish his messianic reign upon the earth. Christ will distribute rewards to the faithful just. The unjust and non-repentant will suffer a just judgment. Christ's kingly reign will continue forever in a new heaven, a new earth, and a new Jerusalem. How would you complete this list or change its order? Are the events of this book imaginary symbols or events that have already been fulfilled? Could these events yet come to pass literally in time and space?